What is up, everybody? Hey, how's it going? Welcome to the show. It looks like, do we have audio? I mean, it's like been, it's been a little while. Thank you very much for everybody. It looks like people are already contributing. We see some subs uh, already happening and all that sort of stuff. Welcome to the show, guys. We have a really cool show today, and it is good to be back. Welcome to what we're calling the, the month of builds. It's, uh, it's, it's no, like, no mod workshops till the very end of the, sit the month. It's just you and us hanging out doing builds, celebrating September with a brand new PC giveaway, and so much more. Jafaz, thank you very much. Three, 27 months, man. That dude has been uh, sub, dude. I appreciate it. I miss you guys, too. It's so good to see everybody. My music is a little loud in the studio, so I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Um, mute, loud music is loud. Is it, whoa, oh, whoa, hold on. That's why it's so loud. There we go, and that's where it's supposed to be. Yell over the music. Sorry, we're getting into the back into the groove here. Okay, guys, I am back. There we go, sorry about that. Uh, I am back, it is back, it is time, and it has been crazy between PAX, um, and then we just, we have, we have a really cool October, but I'm really excited just to spend some time with you guys on September. We've got a brand new fall schedule that'll be coming out tomorrow uh, that officially moves the time to 5 p.m. Uh, and then you guys are still getting pretty much all the same streams. I think Friday's the only day that we're actually gonna, we're gonna kill and move over to um, just doing on Saturdays. But it's gonna be super fun and I'm really excited about it. Today also, you guys have seen us showing it here on the show, but we finally got the okay uh, from Gigabytes. So we're gonna be giving away as part of September. Remember, September is here, 30% off all the subs. So as part of September, we're celebrating with a crazy PC. We're gonna be giving away that Project Stealth PC, which nobody has. It is just now launching this month from, uh, so from Main Gear. Um, you'll be one of the first people to win it. And if we hit to 2,000 subs in the month of September, then we will give away that, that thing. So it is a subathon. We're gonna make it really hot. So open up those things, help our team do really cool stuff like Hunt to War and Aegea doing, and you'll get a really rad PC um, as well. So uh, which should be super cool. So that's happening. Uh, we also, um, we're gonna change things up. So I know that, uh, so we're gonna finish out September because remember August and September, we're gonna be giving away a 3080, but starting in uh, October, when we get to October, we're gonna change the sub goal for the month. I think a lot of people, Hype Train started, you guys are rock stars. Uh, we're gonna change things up. So we're thinking of other things to give away uh, instead of like the monthly GPU giveaway, um, though I know that we're getting really close to things. So we might do stuff like give away a 7,000 series, a 7,000 series CPU uh, in uh, October as well. And maybe just give away some really nice like new CPUs and things like that as a, as a kind of kick things off uh, with, the, uh, with the new thing. I'm also really excited because we are in with AMD. I'm excited to announce, I don't know if you guys just saw uh, the video that launched uh, yesterday with Origin, uh, but we are officially now doing stuff with in partnership with AMD, so look for a lot of AMD content as well. Um, we are gonna be covering the new CPUs. We got some new pre-builds coming in from them. All sorts of really great stuff. And we're gonna have them here on the show in the next couple of couple weeks. They're gonna be here to answer your questions, uh, specifically as we get into 7000 series launch and a bunch of stuff like that. So we got a lot coming up from them and I know everybody's really excited about the AMD side of things. Um, I wanna give a huge shout out to Org Chaos who told me about those brand new fans from Cooler Master. We have some new fans coming in from Cooler Master and also from uh, the folks over at Be Quiet to test some of those things out. So guys, all all of the tech content, we're gonna try and get as much as we can uh, here in uh, this month as humanly possible. And then at the same time, we've also just got some really great pre-built systems that we're also gonna be doing as part of pre-built and gaming. Uh, we've got a really cool one coming up on Tuesday with Corsair. Um, we're gonna be showing off a bunch of their IQ stuff and then another uh, pre-built system. Saturday, uh, I mean, uh, either Saturday or Monday, we're waiting, we're trying to find out. We're supposed to build Albert's PC, but his motherboard got messed up. So it's either gonna be tomorrow or it's gonna be Monday. Remember that massive 5000T water-cooled build that we, uh, we were working on? Well, it's finally done. And so we're gonna finish that here on the show. Finally get all the custom water cooling. So you guys have been asking about that. That's finally gonna get finished. So we got so much really rad stuff. So let me talk about the other giveaways so you guys know what's going on uh, as well. So we have the usual, if we get to, uh, if we get two level five hype trains, which I wasn't even paying attention, and I, I have to say a thank you to all everybody who's done that. I'll make sure that I go in and say thank you to everybody who's done that, like Hunt to War, and so many people are just dropping, 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 dropping it like it's hot right now. Uh, I'll come over there and say thank you for that, but two level five hype trains will give away a $25 uh, uh, new a gift card. 
If we get 400 likes, 400, let's start low because it's been a while. If we get 400 likes over at youtube.com slash rubytech, we'll also give away a $25 uh, new a gift card. Uh, and then lastly, uh, uh, yeah, we, we'll give away two, sorry, two $25 new a gift cards. And then lastly, uh, we have that 3080 that's up for grabs for the month of August and September. Um, so if we get to, uh, if we get those um, and we're good to go there, uh, then what we're gonna do is we'll, uh, the way you get in on that, uh, just drop your free Amazon Prime sub. Use your Amazon Prime subscription uh, that gets you in to enter to win uh, the 3080, uh, as long as you're sub during the month of August and September. But if you wanna get more entries, you can subscribe it to your two, uh, that gets you, uh, sorry, subscribe it to your one, that gets you uh, five entries. Subscribe it to your two, gets you, no, sorry, subscribe it to your one, gets you three entries. Subscribe it to your two, gets you five entries. And subscribe it to your three, gets you 10 entries. And then every gifted subs, like so many people also get you extra entries towards winning those GPUs. And then of course, we have the Project Stealth giveaway, which we've been showing off, uh, and that's also happening. So we're already, uh, what, 2% on our way there, and you guys kicked it off, so which is really, really cool. The train is off the rails, that's right, and, and we still have two minutes left. But let me say thank you to everybody who did that. Let's see what else we got here. One Dark Man, thank you for the resub. Hunt to War, 10 subs already. Or Chaos, thank you very much for the sub. Riddick dropping five gifted subs. Hunter, Hunter War, another 10 gifts to subs. Nagia one, Hunter War, another 10. SRT Balthazar, Drafaz, Mr. Houston, Hidden Attribute. All of you guys, welcome and thank you so much for all of the gifted subs. So yeah, thank you so much for all of that stuff and you guys. And then we got we got Black, Black Rays, Black Rose. Oh, that's a cool way to spell that name. Thank you very much for the two gifted subs as well, dude. So. Hidden at 27 months. We had your Faws at 27 months. We have some crazy Cosmic Jornet at 26 months. So we got some really, really crazy long, 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 long going uh, subs here. And I think it's actually very soon. I need to find out. I don't know, Bloody, if you could find out. I know I did an announcement, it, but I think we're coming up on my first year, or we may have just passed my first year as a full-time content creator. So um, I don't, I, for some reason, I don't know exactly when that was, but it'd be good to know. 26 months from Cosmic, that's huge. So is everybody having a good day? It's good to see you guys. It's good to see everybody. Is everybody having like a quality day? Did you, did you miss me? Um, and, you know, we got, we got a lot going. Yes, I miss you guys too. I miss you very, very much. I really did. Um, wasn't that, I, I don't remember. So I think it was September. I think it's September, Blondie. Um, because I think my last day at Microsoft was September. But yeah. Where's the ice stream? Do we have an ice stream? I would love to have ice stream. Yeah, you're glad the week's over? Why, what was so bad about it? Super Doomsday, thank you for the resub. Oh, the ice stream. Ah, uh, you know, oh, ice. You know, it's funny, like, I have ice downstairs. Maybe we'll redo it. Maybe if it's, we'll get some ice. Eating steak, other than to having to cook the steak myself, it's a good day. Oh, well, that's, that's unfortunate. <laughs> also, much, how much RGB did I consume today? It's actually been pretty crazy. We're going to the new studio PC. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this, unless you've seen the video, but we'll do a little show and tell here. This is the new studio PC. Uh, that we built. It's in the, um, this one is actually, I built in partnership with Liquid House. Uh, this one was done uh, in the, uh, in the um, Fantex Evolve Shift XT. Um, it's a full hard loop, custom water cooled, um, small form factor PC. So we've got, it's a, um, it's actually a uh, 12600K with a RTX 3090. Uh, and then this one is just so, we, it's for gaming in a small thing. And then you can see it's got the, uh, it's got both sides there in terms of the hard cooling. And then the front is actually a screen. So this right here is actually a screen for showing temps and all that sort of stuff. So we've done some modification uh, to it um, just to make sure it stays solid because it's only, it's only cooled by a single uh, 240 millimeter radiator and then two um, Fantex, uh, two Fantex, uh, those T30, uh, those T30 uh, fans. So came out very, very clean. I love how clean this came out, but this is gonna be our new PC. Um, for basically playing gadget. How much to make that? So if you were gonna make this PC uh, with timing and everything like that, I mean, these the, the parts actually aren't that expensive. The hard part is getting the specific uh, GPU for the look. Um, but yeah, no, I don't, I don't actually know how much it would cost anymore to make it. I, I, don't, I didn't really pay attention. So that's actually a good question. I don't know. Uh, we actually have the parts. We did it on the, you can actually go watch the video uh, on it and it, the part links might be there. Uh, your 12900K, you couldn't cool with a single 240 and a, with a 3090. Yeah. 
So it's nothing about, it's, it's about making sure that it actually performs temp-wise. So it was about giving a lot of headroom for both the GPU and the CPU, so. Yeah, it's pretty, it's a pretty cool system, so. But uh, how's everybody else doing better? Everybody else doing good? Looks like lots of, lots of people here joining us already. Yeah, definitely. Cooling concerns with small, with uh, cooling concerns, definitely. 12700K, we think actually, and once we got finished doing temps, because I mean, the temps on the CPU were actually in the low, in the low 70s, so we probably could do a 12700K. So, yeah. We, did, we just wanted to make sure, we just wanted to make sure that we were, we were for sure, we didn't want to take it apart. If it, and it, and 12600K with a 3090 is a great 1440p. So, I missed you too, BMOX. Sorry about yesterday. Uh, okay, so people are excited. Since I need that electric volt Pelican case. So guys, we're gonna be building that. We're gonna be building V2 of that here on the stream. Uh, if you guys didn't see that Liquid House uh, Pelican stream, we're actually gonna be building the second version of it here on the stream this month. So we're gonna actually fly John in. He's gonna join us here. Uh, and then we're gonna finish it as part of TwitchCon and uh, the Creator Challenge, which is happening in San Diego. We're gonna be working with PC Works to finish all the final touches, but we'll actually have one of those and build it here in the studio. So you guys will be able to see the entire thing from end to end where, here on the show. So, <clears throat> so yeah. Yeah, it should be it should be very very cool. And you guys are gonna get to see the whole process right here. So that's uh, we've we've reached out to Pelican. Oh, I just realized my steel. I uh, reach out to Pelican. Asus is in a partnership with that, and then um, the uh, Kingston. So we're gonna be doing it with Kingston. Uh, it's gonna be all black, not uh, yellow and white, because we're actually gonna change uh, some of the stuff uh, to make sure we can do something just a little bit more powerful. But it should be pretty cool. Um, so yeah, it should be should be really really good. Um, I'm trying to see what else is going on here. Everybody's saying hi. Good to see you. It's good to see everybody. I'm, I'm, a, I'm super excited. Okay, you guys want to talk about, we've already gotten through the level five hype train, so I've just, I'm actually just spending a little time with you guys because I just feel like I missed you. But today's build, today's build is in this little bad boy. That's right, we're doing a small form factor, air-cooled build today. Figured we'd kick off build month and it'll be mostly all new cases. We're trying to do as many cases as we can. That PC, so we have a video coming out on this. This is a brand new PC from Origin. It actually has something unique to it. Check this out. This is an Origin exclusive for the 5000D and I actually really dig it. And it's a, uh, it's a new uh, case for the 5000D airflow. It's actually angled a bit. So it's actually, and it gives us just a little bit more of a differentiation. So uh, this is, but this one was a custom PC that we built in partnership with Origin. Uh, and we actually customized it even more. So not only is it, it's not something you could do like off the website, we like use their custom exclusive stuff. So it's all uh, ML120 elites, um, push pull configuration. So just showing that you can do more than just the configurator on uh, the uh, PC. So pretty cool build. Um, and then we'll have a video on that coming out in the next couple weeks. So that's what that is. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it's an itsy bitsy fractal. Dude, Hunter Wars on fire today. Super Doomsday, thank you very much as well. Yeah, it's pretty cool. No, the blue water one. Oh, that's not a case. Well, it is a build, but that's actually our, this is our height Y60. That's our height Y60 fish tank with, uh, with it did have actual fish in it at one point in time, but now we took the fish out because I, I, I'm gone too much. So uh, it's got the uh, 3080 flounders edition um, and so much more, but that's actually a fish tank. Yeah. Yeah, it's a fish tank built into an eye white, an eye white, a height white 60, yeah. So, but it's an itsy bitsy fractal today. Yeah, it was pretty cool. Um, and I, they were actually gonna be doing some other stuff with them because uh, they have, uh, we're gonna be putting a, a cool one in this other height Y60 that's sitting down here. We got some cool stuff coming up for that too. Okay, let's talk about what we are putting in this today. Uh, you are right, we are gonna be, it is a Ryzen build today, so we're gonna be doing a Ryzen 7 5800X um, just because it runs warm and we always like to use warmer, basically high-end CPU or warmer CPUs um, just to make sure that we test the airflow, et cetera, uh, for this build. I have all the stuff for it. The review actually comes out for this, is already out for this. So if you guys wanted to see how this build does, it's actually already out, the whole review's out and all that sort of stuff. Uh, Roby, what happened to the open air case behind you that was starting? You mean that one right there? Uh, we never finished it. So yeah, do you, do you like it? Cause we have like, it's got like an EVGA 3080 for it and it's an 11th gen. 
And so it never, it never, we just never did anything with it. So yeah, that's, that's what we did. Uh, he wants it as a new test bench. Uh, you know, it's so funny. It's like, it's got the, uh, it's got the, uh, it's got the ballistics max, uh, like 4,000 megahertz RAM. And I mean, it's basically, it's got those Cooler Master fans. Yeah, I don't know. Uh, we are gonna be doing another build that's gonna take that side though. So yeah, we're gonna be doing something in partnership with, uh, with another creator, so it should be cool. What's up, Pig Radio? It's good to see you. But yeah, but anyway, back to this. We're using a Ryzen 7 5800X. Uh, for our motherboard, we're using the RG Strix B550i Gaming. Um, I'm actually really excited about B550 or B660 as it's coming up for uh, B660, right? Did, is it B5, is it B650? It's B650, isn't it? Not B660. It's B650, right? Somebody help me. My mind just literally freaking crapped on itself. Uh, anyway, uh, the uh, the um, basically these are the budget boards from B650. Okay, phew, thank you, Org. Uh, B650 from uh, AMD, love these boards. Like the one thing that we always love um, uh, over the, the one thing that I like on these over Intel specifically is just you can do some overclocking with these. Uh, they are launching later than the X670 boards uh, for Ryzen 7000, but love the RG Strix ones. These are going to be great. We'll be showing this off. Uh, you know, it's just a good board, and uh, you can still do a lot with it. Though the though they're right, the 5800X runs like the sun. Um, for our uh, mobile, I mean, so for our RAM, we're using the Corsair Vengeance LPX 3600. We got 16 gigs uh, and two by eight configuration. Uh, we got a one terabyte CRK Fire Cuda 530. Huge shout out, obviously, dude, Hunter War. You're on fire, my man. Thank you so much for all those subs. We're almost, we're almost like. Well, like 5% there, it's mostly Hunter War. Thank you, my man, for all of that stuff and for being such a huge supporter. Um, 7,000 megabits, and then huge shout out to, obviously, to uh, uh, Seagate for being such a great partner here on the show. We also, I'd like to say, we also have Kingston, who now has joined us, who's just sent a ton of their stuff too. So we'll start showing some more Kingston stuff in there as well. So uh, let's see, what else we got? Um, cooler, this is always fun. We like cool looking air coolers. And this looks really good in the case. It actually showed very well on Instagram. This is the AK620 White from Deep Cool. I just got two of their brand new um, like stock coolers um, as well from them today via Amazon. So uh, huge shout out to Deep Cool for sending those along. We'll throw those into a couple builds. Um, it's, uh, it's their single tower version of this, which actually looks pretty cool. So yeah. This AK620 Zero Dark exists now too, the all black version. Yeah, we, uh, I think they sent us, a, they sent me a bunch of stuff orgs, so we'll have to take a look at that. So yeah, you're a deep cool fan, Mikey Soft. <laughs> I like that name though. Mikey Soft's like, I'm a deep cool fan. Uh, for power, just keeping it all white. Uh, the RM850, white from Corsair. Uh, so it does full, it does support a full, uh, even though this is a small form factor case, it does support an, a full ATX power supply. Uh, and then uh, we're gonna be using, you know, just because, uh, Founders Edition uh, GPU, we're gonna be using the uh, GeForce RTX 3070 Ti. And then we've got the, um, we've got the uh, white extension for it as well. So it uh, should be cool. And I always like to do that. Let me go grab some white cable extensions. Sketchy Nuds, thank you very much for the sub. Mr. Plant as well. I need to go get some water real quick, guys. I'll be right back. So just know that I'll be right. Guardy, thank you very much for the sub. I'll be right back, guys. I'm just gonna mute it, I'll be right back.
Sorry about that, guys. A little bit of uh, some technical stuff, but we got the water, we're good. Okay, anyway, oh, man, after all that sort of stuff, I forgot to grab the stupid white cables. I'm here, though. I'm keeping it not muted, because I was like, I muted, and then I realized I can't talk to you guys and tell you that it's taking a little while. <sighs> Red. I want white. White. White, black. Double black. Double CPU white, that's fine. Okay, cool, here we go. Okay, now we got it. Now we're good. Okay, so anyway, this is the last part. And then we got custom cables, so that's the build. Whew. Clear the chat, what'd you guys say? <laughs> sub silent thing for the resub. People are like talking. Oh man, Hunt to War at 70 subs already. Jeez, I'm crow, man. Oh, I understand, Guardy. And you know what? It's okay. I still love you. What did you need to know? Oh, just got, oh, that's weird. That's weird that it just, you just got the notification because we have definitely been live longer than just now. Oh, you know, I'm just putting all the stuff over here. Let's get this stuff back. Ooh, man, I'm just like. <laughs> yeah, I know, Hunt to War. It was like, uh, it was more than that. Uh, the other thing too is it also, I don't know if you guys know this, but we just literally, a, a video just went live as well. <laughs> oh, she's gonna be the host of Blondie Tech, huh? She's got that brand new PC. Um, you could do some modification. Uh, yeah, I guess the hard part would be... Oh, by the way, check this out. If you're talking about the all-white front, this is pretty cool. Look at what they, they ship it with. Look at this, like, neat little... This neat little thing that it actually came on it. This is what essentially what he wants. So he wants it like that. And that, that like, a little cover goes on the front of it. So it's like that. And that's what you want right there, right? But that is... That, isn't that pretty cool? It's, 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 it, it provides no function. I just thought when I took it out, I was like, oh, I'm gonna show you this because it's so cool. Blade of Ice, thank you very much for that. So it would be clean. I thought this was neat that they did this. So I, I don't know, I saved this just to show you. What's up, Blade of Ice? It's good to see you, man. Okay, um, okay, we can move the case over here. Luckily, this is so small that uh, you can just kind of move it around. It would look pretty cool, right? Look, it'd, be, it'd, look, it'd look nice and clean, wouldn't it? Okay, so uh, I'm really excited. I don't know if you guys saw, a video just went live on YouTube, literally while I was live here. Um, and it's uh, the game Steel, Seri uh, Steel Rising, which we're playing today after the show, is actually works on the Steam Deck right out of the gate, which is actually pretty cool. In fact, they patched it yesterday, but we have a whole video on it. If you want a brand new game, it's a, it's a action RPG souls light game. Um, and uh, Souls-like RPG, action RPG game, set in like uh, the, uh, in during the French Revolution. But yeah, it works on the deck, really, really cool experience and uh, runs at like, runs at like 30 frames per second. So we got some optimization stuff. That's the video that just came out, but yeah. Um, let's uh, start this now. First one. Oh, never mind. we can't do that. That's a sad, I'm actually hoping AM5, I, 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 we haven't gotten any AM5 motherboards yet, and even if we did, I couldn't tell you. Um, but um, I'm hoping that they have the, 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 IO, the, the cover, because I like to see the cover jump over, and I realize I just got bummed out because we can't do that uh, prediction because we don't have it. Yeah, it's a steampunk French Souls-like game. But this one's like super messed up, but it looks pretty cool. It's, it's been fun, I've played about two hours of it, and you guys are gonna see some more of it tonight. Don't worry for those playing WoW. WoW is coming, but I'm level 70 already, so I'm just waiting for the Wrath stuff to start. Oh, with oh, and apparently Fall Guys also works on the deck, which we're, uh, you have to just install the new um, Proton GE to, to get that to work. I don't think I need anything else out of this, so there's that. So we don't have a, we will have RAM clicks. Uh, that'll be the next pro, that'll be the next one. RAM clicks. It's Vengeance. It's vengeance. So let's say, okay, Blondie, let's say, let's say 97. Let's say 97. Bernie's here. What's up, buddy? Uh, let's do 97. What's up, Iron Master? It's good to see you, man. We'll do 97 for the, uh, for the, uh, the, the temp, the, the, the volume for the clicks today. Night. Calm down, Roby. 
calm down. Hunter War, 30, taking it to 100 today. He really wants to, he wants that check mark next to his name. Um, okay, there we go. Thank you, Hunter War, man. That's huge. Super appreciate it, man. Blade, have you started your uh, flight stuff yet? And Height Brand got a tier one sub. Is Height in the channel? Twitch will throttle you? I don't think they will. Is Height in the channel? They might be. I met their super cool social media manager, so. Okay, uh, it's been a while. Let's uh, put this in correctly. There we go. Yeah, it's mini ITX. You guys get a big view of it. Now, there was an interesting article that came out from Igor's lab. I don't know if Org saw this or anybody else, but uh, for, it was for GPU. It was, uh, the brand of RAM is uh, Vengeance LPX. Uh, it, was a, it was for GPU specifically, but it talked about the ideal way to place um, thermal paste. Now, we're gonna test this, but they said to do what's called the sausage method, which is where you basically put it right down the center, um, and that the worst performing method for them, which is not true for us, but we're gonna do a test on this anyway because Igor's lab and they're amazing. Uh, they did they entire they did the whole cover. They covered it the same way we do with an even number of thermal paste. And actually, because of the way the pressure was, it ended up with hot spots. Now we haven't seen that on CPUs, and it may be different from dermal and uh, from GPUs. But on the GPU side, it was the worst method. But we're gonna we're gonna check it out. So I'm just saying, somebody's uh, somebody's um, put out some real data, and it made us think. You know what? We're gonna test it. So <clears throat> the GPU die is bare. Yeah, yeah. It's it's a little bit different, right, Bmock? I just, I mean, we water cool, and for water cooling, I've always done the, uh, I've always done the, uh, like a line, uh, not all the way from top to bottom, but just the line anyway. I've never, or I've never spread it, but that was the thing that was in there. Yeah, it's curved. Okay. Well, there you go. There, B-Mock. It's different than the CPU, but the CPU, we're going to continue to do that until we do some testing. But Igor put a, a whole video out, I mean, a whole vi uh, article out on it. There we go. Little, little, uh, I think this tube is empty. Another knock to a tube gone. The other thing, too, is uh, I want to let people know. Well, actually, never mind. I'll, I'll tell you about it later. We are probably going to, uh, we canceled the Friday streams because uh, we're going to investigate doing a tech, like, similar. We're going to look at trying to adding a weekly tech like uh, podcast type thing, just so we can get some more people and start getting some people on the show um, who are like like our techs and stuff like that, our tech specialists and people like that. So uh, look for some more info about that a little bit later. Um, and we'll, uh, that'll be coming up too. Thank you, Mario, appreciate it, I try to be. I'm being called out on, I'm being called out on social now for all of my, for my clothing because I've been changing up my, my style a little bit. I got some feedback that I was looking a little too, too oldish, daddish. So I was like doing some research on some cool brands, some brands that I liked. Um, and then now people are saying I'm drippy and I'm like, what? I was like, I'm not drippy, but it's been funny. <laughs> uh, Mrs. Roby is dealing with, so kids, the kids were uh, at school for the, like, they just came off strike on Wednesday. So my kids, so like, she's catching up with getting them into school and stuff like that. My daughter, you know, so we'll do a little daughter hype here. So first, she's the only freshman to be in the fall musical at her high school. So um, her, she got, she was the only freshman. Everyone else was sophomore or higher. Um, and she's pretty proud of that. So she's got, she's a, She's a big kind of show person like dad. Um, and so she was really excited about that. Will you do a shirtless PC stream? No. But I've been, I've been told to update my style from people. So that's what I was doing. I still want to build my own PC. But yeah, I think it'd be cool to have people like Bmock or Chaos. I don't know if Org would ever do it, but some of those people and like have them like Tom 
or uh, other people to talk, uh, to have, be on our, our, pod, our tech podcast. Oh, thanks, Zudi. So yeah, that was a, it was a, it was part of that, that whole like, hey, you got to get better, Roby. You were starting to let yourself go, but I don't know if they'd be down. <clears throat> uh, I have, so this is a, we actually have links to this stuff. These are Thermal Grizzly uh, Paste Spread. Oh, it'd be pretty cook. According to BMOC, it'd be pretty cook. Uh, these are uh, Thermal Paste Spreaders. You can get them from Thermal Grizzly. Um, and uh, you can check those out. They're pretty cool. No, we're not hiring right now. We're, we're uh, we have a pretty big team, but it's all really, really good people. He says, cool. He said, cool. So yeah, look for some details on that, BMOC. I don't know if Org, if you'd be down either. And Tom, I'm trying to think of people who might be down to do it. But it'd be, it'd be live on YouTube. Okay, so we got that. Look at how even that is. That looks so pretty. That was just a very nicely painted, nicely painted uh, thing. Okay, time for the clicks, guys. Time for the RAM clicks. Oh, Cyber, that's actually not a bad idea from the, uh, like, what are the... Okay, well, there we go. Uh, it's, uh, it's, uh... Oh, what is it called? Um, uh, oh, what are those things called? The cheese and cracker things. Yeah, I know what you're talking about. Those red spreaders. Yeah, those would work too. It's okay, Arg. I get it. You can just you can just come and do it in chat or this way, which is fine too. Okay, here we go. Nine. What did we say? Nine. What did we say it was? What did I say it was? Did we put the bet up already? 97? Is the bet already been up, uh, Blondie? Is the prediction already up? Yes, okay, cool. 97, guys. We'll, put the, we'll pause the music here in just a second. Here we go. Yeah, so 97.1, yes, is what it'd have to be, is what we said. Okay, first one, guys. Whoa. Oh, geez, hold on, do it right. Ooh, 94, ooh, that's pretty mushy. I don't think this is gonna happen this time. I don't think this is gonna happen this time, guys. Nope, not even close. That is terrible. That was terrible. That was terrible. It was not that good. I thought it would actually do pretty good. Yeah, 97 was a high bar, but I was I was I, I wanted to come back with like a smash, you know what I mean? It was terrible. That was like not very good. So uh, for those of you who uh, tried to support me by thinking it was gonna be good. I'm sorry, I let you down. I let you down. I did, I just said I'm sorry. I apologize. Okay, let's put this M.2 in. Take it or leave it. Take it or leave it. I'm sorry, Hunt to War. I thought I was gonna do good. Apparently I did not know. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's get this in. Oh, thanks, Riddick. Wait, Bobby, you lied. Bobby lied. <laughs> if I hit it with a hammer, that seems like not a good idea, <laughs> but you're probably right. Dude, it was Brian, not Brian. I didn't know you could see how somebody voted, Blondie. Blondie knows all. I don't even, I don't even know why I doubt it. It usually they do, right? Org, like, of course, uh, Asus has a tendency to be nice, solid RAM clicks. So I, that's why I was going in there. 
Okay, here we go. Let's get our, uh, let's get our very fat uh, 530 in here, one terabyte. Oh, I love how these boards look. I love how these, I love how these uh, NVMEs look. I did, I called that SIM.2 fat because it's P-H-A-T fat. I'm using all the cool lingo. I didn't body shame, I called it fat like P-H-A-T because I know all the stuff. Like I know how to spill the tea. I know how to, I know when somebody's sus. That's what I'm saying. Look at me with all my lingo. I know when something's mid, like here's the thing, those RAM clicks were mid. Look at me with all my, with all my new lingo. <laughs> oh my God, Zudi, that made me laugh. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh man. Uh. <laughs> His kids be cringing. I'm, yeah, uh, no, I don't think so, Max Bunny. I mean, something may eventually change, but I don't think, I don't think uh, it will go the way of that. It's like, it's, I mean, like I know for Gen 5 and stuff like that, it's still going to be uh, this, this, this style. Okay, we can zoom out a bit because it's cooler time. Yeah, it's a freaking great NVMe drive. I, lo I love that uh, we get to do some great stuff with Seagate. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, guys, we are at 123. Can we get to 250 today? Can we get 10% of the way towards that Project Stealth giveaway? Ratio low key, bro. What does that mean? I didn't, uh, uh, it's already off the page, uh, Bobby Kate. Bob, you gotta, you're gonna have to put it again. I gotta build a PC. Yeah, Julian Morrow, they're, uh, they're really good for the PS5. They're a little overpriced for a PS5. Oh, is Pig having, uh, is Pig, are you eating, uh, are you eating uh, pizza today? Oh, <laughs> hey Bailey's like, I have no idea what it means. But Tim the Tatman says it. That means it must be hip. You make pizza every Friday? Oh, nice. That's pretty cool. I'm so used to looking for LGA 1700 that uh, it's blowing my mind. Okay, let's see how to do this on AM4 and AM4. Okay. It's like all the way in the back. Okay, so we remove them on this one. Okay, here we go. It's like the old school way. I was hoping for like the actually use it bracket, but okay. Okay, let's grab our hard drive, our, our hard drive, our uh, screwdriver. It's been, it has been, I'm trying to think of the last one. We didn't do one that long ago. We did another 5800X for another build. I don't remember what it was. Well, it's funny because AM4, I think we're gonna do, I think there's a 5800X 3D build coming up. Uh, MC, MI, Mixie, yeah, we are still doing it, but they we're taking, I'm taking far less commissions now. Just because we have a lot of just new cases to get in there. A lot of new cases, a lot of new things to show through. So um, yeah, we can, it's just, you gotta reach out and see. I still do commissions, but. Not very many. Mm -hmm. 
We're doing we're doing Riddick's. Uh, Riddick's getting a de uh, a Deadpool one. Um, we're doing Albert's tomorrow, but I think those are the only two on my list. But yeah, dude, just reach out via Roby Tech and, uh, and we'll see if we got room. Like I, I think I try to do like two a month. So if you want to take one of those spots, jump on it soon. Okay, that's that. Now we put on this, which is why they're sitting in here. <clears throat> Don't be afraid to use the instructions, guys. Don't be afraid. If you do that, you will find yourself sorely disappointed in your life when things don't go your way. What's going on with the Twitch lag, Hunter War? Juniper Perosera, thank you very much for the sub, man. Appreciate it. Boom, boom, boom. I'm not in demand, I just, uh... Yeah, it's something that I hope at some point in time that Twitch lets uh, multiple bit rates to non-partners, because I'm not going to ever be a partner, even though I'm going to TwitchCon, um, because I want to uh, stream, I get to stream to multiple platforms at the same time, and I don't want to take lose that, because my YouTubers. Aw, oh, thanks, MCM. I try, I do try. There we go. Am I using an Elgato capture card? Uh, we're using a 4K 60S, but uh, the, the, all of the stuff that you're seeing that you're capturing is done via Camlink, the Camlink Pro. Sergeant Nobody, to answer your question. Okay, that should be everything there. Got a little bit of a splitter here. There we go. Yeah, uh, Elgato's always been a close friend to the show, so. Which is all, which I which I love. I mean, I, I like their products a lot. Okay, so we're good here. Let's do this. So we've got two. And does this have RGB? Yeah, no. Okay. So we want to take this one out. There we go. Okay, I'm just making sure I'm putting this on the right way. There we go. There it is. Uh, no, because I use, here's how I know it's not backwards, because the, look. I, how I checked was this. The logo is the right way. So if I put it the other way, the logo would be wrong. But the fans might be on wrong. That could be a thing. But the logo's on right, yeah. The, fo the, fa the fans might be on wrong, but the logo is right. Igor, what's up, buddy? So I think you're right, though. Yeah, the fan goes in the front. So I'm gonna fix that.
So there's that one. And then this goes in the middle. Okay, that is right. I was double checking because it's been a while. Are you, you feel better, uh, Ord? I need to get, uh, I need to order a, um, I need to order an ice giant. I haven't played with that. I think you're playing with an ice giant. We need to do some more ice giant builds. Needs a third fan. Nah, that's fine. Dude, it's only 5,800X. Oh, wait, here, <laughs> it needs, it needs water. It needs something. Okay, let's get this hooked up. Okay, let's get this. I'm gonna work on getting this clean. Get this hidden underneath there. So we got we got so we got that all nice and pretty. Nice and pretty. Nice and pretty. Okay, here we go. Let's get this clean under here. Gotta make it look good. Gotta make it look nice and pretty. Nice and pretty. Gotta make it look good. I haven't, like, I haven't, I haven't honestly worked with one before. Like I have actually, sorry, that's actually not true. We did one, I actually have one for TRX 40. So I actually have an Ice Giant for TRX, but I've never done one on like a normal build. Hey Igor, thank you very much, man. Are you just in, are you out for the night or? Wow, Max Bunny, just come in here dropping knowledge, huh? What am I looking for? Looking for my clippers. Right there. You're waiting for the cable management part? Okay, so that's now hidden. So now you can't see any cables, which is always good. That's straight. Okay. Build is ready to go into, oh, wait. Uh, zip tie count, I almost threw one away. Even or odd, folks. Even or odd zip tie count. Oh, I'm sorry, Igor. We earned it. We earned. We made it earlier. We made it earlier, though. So the show is now earlier. So hopefully, more people can hang out and be a part of things. You know, so like people like Farger and all those guys who haven't been able to play. That's my favorite. What's your favorite part, Dever? Okay, here we go, guys. Going to camp. we go. Time to strip this baby. And it actually strips really nicely. There we go. I'm trying to think of, we'll put it over here. Grab our Now one little trick if you're going to build in this case, by the way guys, one little trick. Make sure that you uh, make sure that you why you route everything through the um, this corner up here because it's like the world's smallest hole. There you go. Pop this back. There we are.
Okay. And there we go, front. So this hole up here is super, super, super tiny. So we're gonna go ahead and run this. And then the other thing too is because we know how small it is and uh, we've already done this build, we're gonna run our EPS cable through already. So that way it's just a lot easier. So go to side camera. Just realize that is much lower than it needs to be. It's got a great focus on the, uh, it's got a great focus on the Steam Deck. There we go. Okay, so we're gonna grab our EPS CPU connector. There it is. Uh, case fans we're using, we're using the stock ones, but we are gonna add a single because the case actually only comes with two uh, fans. Uh, we have a rear, the Noctua, and then this one also, the, sorry, the Fractal and the Fractal. We're gonna add a Noctua NFA-12 as well. So I'm gonna go ahead and run this through here. Just to save myself some pain. It's a neat little trick if you're building inside of this case, what you should do. get the rest of those later. Okay, let's grab our fan here. Go ahead and get that installed real quick. And then we'll get our case, or, or we'll get our, we'll get our uh, thing in. Now, one thing that's really cool about this case, I don't know if you saw this, let me show you this on the side view, but check this out. Something they did add, now if you wanna remove, if you wanna put an AIO in, but, ooh, it's hard to see. They actually added, it's got like a channel, like a light channel. Um, for like, like basically it's an air channel for the rear fan. Can you see that very well? Yeah, you guys can see that. Yeah, okay, so let me, you can see that? Look at that. It's pretty cool. You can see that little air channel right there to help blow the fan air up, which is actually pretty neat. Now you can change that if you wanna throw like a, a radiator and an AIO in the front, but for air cooling, it's cool to just get the GPU some additional air. Well, we're excited about it, and John, don't worry, we'll have builds the day of. So once it comes out, we'll be here building. You guys will get to see the builds. We'll do live, live, uh, live benching and all that sort of stuff. So you guys will get to see it here, right here on the show. I think actually Fractal probably gave me things. So that's an interesting thing. It's get, it's definitely gonna be expensive because X670, it's gonna be cheaper probably once the B56, B650 launches. You'll probably see it come down in price, especially because that by that point in time, uh, 13th gen will probably be out as well. So um, I do expect it to drop in price. CPU competition is nice and steep and uh, one of the big ways that they fight each other is via is via money. So I do expect it to become less expensive. And I think really where you'll see a lot of that value will come out of um, what you see uh, with their more uh, value prop be um, their more value propositioned uh, budget motherboards. Because X uh, even X570 X570 stayed expensive even after like, you know, 11th gen and stuff like that. So, and it's still even pricey. You know what, they did not give me a single, they did not give me a single fan. Oh, that's lame. Why would you not give me fan, fan screws? Why are you not giving me fan screws? Yeah, I think you're, I think you're absolutely right. I think November will be the time to buy. Cause I'm, I'm guessing by that point in time, we'll have both of them in there. 
And then everything will be about the hype for 7,000 Radeon and 4,000 series NVIDIA at that point. So yeah. And yeah, that's the one thing that people do need to know is that it will require DDR5. So there is no DDR4 option, which is also the thing. I'm excited just for competition. I think we're gonna see a lot. I like, I like competition. It's good for us consumers. Uh, Dalish is probably, uh, probably mid next year. If I was gonna guess, it'll be a while. The mobile versions, yeah. Though I'm actually really excited about them because heat looks like it's not gonna be as big of an issue, which will be cool. <laughs> that was a play on words. I didn't even mean to. Didn't even mean to. Yeah, I don't know, like, again, if it, I mean, like, it sounds like, it sounds like we're gonna have this weird thing, and I don't think it'll be with CPUs, but with GPUs, uh, it sounds like we're gonna have 3000 series and um, 7000 series coexisting, which is a bit of a surprise. He must have. Oh. Put it in on this side one. Oopsie. Oopsie. Just gonna run that cable, but. So we'll have a coexisting finally, which is, wait, no, I don't know about finally, that's gonna be really weird. Oh shoot. Yeah, that's gonna be odd. I don't actually like that. But we'll see. I mean, to some degree it did it a little bit with um, the 10 series and 20 series, and there's still some 10 series cards, but it's just gonna make it confusing for consumers, which I don't like confusing consumer situations. There we go. Where is, there it is. I'm just looking for my screw hole. I think I'm gonna have to lower this a little bit. Oh! Just getting this set up here. It's a little easier from the front, so you guys maybe can see it a little bit better. Once I get these in, then it comes a whole lot simpler. Sorry, you got a great view of my shoulder. Here we go. Here we go. And there we go. Okay, let's put these last two in and then we'll have, we, also, we only have three fan headers. So I gotta be really smart about this. I'm gonna go ahead and grab an extension. We'll run one for our exhaust and the other two will be run off the same fan header is the plan. So, there we go. Okay, cool. Just gonna take a look here at what we got. So you got that one. So I want to probably go ahead and grab a fan header, a fan header out of my bag, my bag of tricks. I wonder if I've got one. I might have one here. Let me see. One's a little bit thinner. Let's see what we got here. And not in there. Got one in here somewhere. That is not one. RGB lights. 
fan extension. Again, not what I wanted. Hmm. We bought we bought a bunch, but I'm lo I'm looking to see if we if I happen to have one just sitting in here. So I'm going to go grab one out of the storage room. Oh, is this it? Yeah, that worked. Okay, cool. Got one. Fan extension. Okay. Whoa. <laughs> okay, so it was 9.4. So 9.4 was my, yeah, I know. My 9.4, guys, was my one year, my one year anniversary as a full-time, as a full-time streamer. So I am just now, so we'll have to do, we'll have to do a uh, special for like my one year. So we'll do something cool. I, I'm gonna come up with something for my one year and then uh, we'll, we'll have to do that. Yeah, it's my, my first full year. I've now done it for an exactly one whole year. Okay, let's get this put in. Thank you for, I was like, and I forgot about that, Blondie. That was such a sweet thing to say. Hey, uh, Tom, can Tom put that back at the top for this one? Because that was pretty neat. One year and five days. Oh, 9-4 is your birthday. Oh, really? Well, cool. All right, here we go. Top down. I ran that through. We've, by the way, we already have the, uh, we already have the, uh, the um, motherboard cable in there. So, I mean, sorry, the motherboard uh, plate, IO shield. So just as an FYI, somebody's like, oh, you forgot the eye shield. I didn't. It's already here. Okay. And before I get too crazy, I'm going to go ahead and grab. Does this come off? No, that'd be pretty nice. I'm going to go ahead and grab the, grab the actual, grab one more thing here. Route this through. This is always the fun part of doing small form factor is that you didn't, you're like, oh, I need to re I need to pre-route this. And so, so I can plug this in before I plug in the motherboard. There we go. Okay, now let's go and take this. and run this and go ahead and install our CPU. Doing this before you secure the motherboard. form factor. I think you're you're seeing me a lot less stressed about this build, I'll be honest, because of we had done I had done it once before. Because I'll be honest, the first time I did this, I was super frustrated. It is 
Okay. Okay. Okay, so now let's grab our, because if you didn't do it this way, you were gonna be like not enjoying life. Now let's grab our motherboard screw. Okay. Oh, shoot. Oh, this cable. I might do. Don't come off. Stay on. Oh, shoot. When you accidentally hit your, there you are. Ugh. I will say, I wish you could use a cable extension for the, the top one. It would actually be easier, but the problem is, is that there's just not enough cable management room to make it work, there we go. Scoot up, there we go. Okay, now we're gonna make the other one go up. We're getting there though, guys. It's coming, it's coming. It's coming. Okay, now, whoops. Oh shoot, come on. Kind of got it, and then I dropped it a little bit, so I'm gonna loosen this. There we go. And I'm batting a thousand here, guys. There we go. No, no, come on. Okay, one more time. That one's actually in really good shape. That one's in really good shape. It's just this one. Okay, got it that time. Okay, that one's in. One more. Okay, so I'm gonna get sure I can get to it again. Okay, screwdriver, there you are. Shoot, that was what I didn't want to do. Steady hands. Shoot. Okay. It's 
steady hands and I dropped it. So not so steady hands. There you go. Okay. I'm gonna do it this way with a stronger magnet. And then this little rotation thing. It could have, I could have done this. Oh shoot, really? I dropped the actual screw head. I don't know where that went. I'm gonna do this one because I can. I'm betting 5,000% right now. Wow. You know what? I know what I need. I know what I need. I need this Excalibur. There we go. Okay, Excalibur got that one in. I forgot about Excalibur. It came in handy. I needed like a really long screwdriver. Question is, where's my... There it is. Okay, got Excalibur now. That's gonna make this a whole lot easier. Thank gosh we have one here in the studio. It's Excalibur. And it's super magnetic, which makes me happy. Okay, there we go. Now it's all in. That was way more work than it should have been, but it's done. SFP, I think I've been saying that for most of the year, that I knew it wasn't gonna be out there. Yes, thank you, Tom, for ordering me Excalibur for the studio. I knew that was gonna be, I didn't think it was going to be, uh, I didn't think it was gonna be this year. There's still, we'll find out more when we see the, uh, now. I mean, we're, we got the thing on the 20th, so we'll see what comes out of that. But I don't think that for most people, it will be something that they'll see uh, or be uh, getting their hands on this year. But we'll see. We will see. Where's my, where's the other fan, the other? Oh, there it is. It's like, where's my screwdriver? over there? It is. Okay. Thank you, Joshua. Okay, so we got all that in. We got our fan thing in. So let's, now what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna pull this stuff tight and down. So to hide it. Just to hide as much of this as we can. Okay. There's our fans. And then what we'll do is we'll just do this. Try and get our small, there we are. Are the fans in a push-push config? These fans are just in a, these fans are in a push exhaust, standard push exhaust, and then they push, yeah, they push the air through the AI, the uh, air cooler, yes. That's your question. Tom, thank you again for ordering Excalibur. Okay, that takes care of that. There's number two. We're now at an even number for that. Okay, that takes care of that. I'm just gonna go ahead and throw it in here because I don't know if we'll have any much extra outside of this little bit here.
Okay, these belong to this. Oops, that doesn't. So there's all our fans hooked up now. Okay, so that's good. So now we just gotta run HD audio, USB 3, USB-C, I mean. I think all this stuff is right here, right? Yeah. Okay, so now let's do USB-C. Yeah, actually, we'll do it this way. I think it's a little easier if you can see it this way. USB 3.2 is on the same side too, right? Yep. USB 3. None of this stuff is twisted up. Okay. Then we have our front panel connections, of which there is two, right? Only two? Yep. And then we have HD audio. And HD audio, we got to push all the way over. And front panel, I think, is. I need to see which one's front panel again. I forgot. I forgot which one's front panel, guys. Okay, we can do these, though. So first up is USB-C. I'm trying to do it so you guys can see. I'm trying to make it so you guys can see it. Okay, USB-C is gonna go right here. Okay, there's USB-C. USB 3.2, same kind of deal. Gotta make sure we come at it from a Move that out of the way, so I can do 90 degrees down. Okay, there's that. HD audio is interesting because it goes white right over here. So we're gonna use our small screwdriver and unconnect, disconnect this little thing right here. We can still get to it without a problem. Or unscrew this. You guys are seeing the challenges of small form factor here. Okay, so then this is gonna cross over and plug in over here and then we'll run it underneath. And this one you got a kind of fish. There it is, there's the fish. No, it'll sit on the things actually, okay. What you can do is you can take a... There we go. There we go, okay, so it's plugged in. Okay, then basically run it under. I'm gonna hide it under the USB, under this gen thing so it'll be hidden. There we go. And then put this back on. There we go. And then we just put, screw this back in. Okay. Okay. Cooking with gas now. 
Now, before we get too crazy, let's go ahead and throw our cable extension in for this. Let me find out where our, forgot where our front panel header is. I forgot where the front panel headers are. We're gonna look real quick, because I don't want to plug them in the wrong place and then not have it turn on. That seems not very smart, Roby. Don't you agree, guys? You want to know where the front panel headers are. Okay, that's USB. So it was where I thought it was. That's front panel audio, speaker, front panel, there it is. It's right where I thought it was, okay, cool. Let's run that real quick. Mm. Found the front panel. It's where I thought I remember it being, but wanted to make sure. Okay, gently put this back down. Gently put it back down. Gently look that back up again. Okay, speakers on the top. Power and a reset underneath, okay. Power and reset. It's like legit twisted here. Legit twisted. Better angle here. Power switch and then reset goes underneath it. There you go, reset. Front back there. Okay, which one is easier to do? Okay, power switch is finally in. That is like legit ridiculous. Okay, cool. Okay, we got that all in now. Got it looking nice. Now let's just throw our cable extension in and then we'll be done with most of the gnarly cables here and then we can finally make it look pretty. Luckily we only need like one cable out of that and that's this 20, the big one. The rest of these we are not going to use at all. We got to make sure the build looks pretty though. Right? Am I right? How are we doing likes on YouTube, guys? Likes on YouTube still progressing. DeBlanc, th uh, DeBlanc, thank you very much for the uh, sub. Appreciate it. We're at 130, guys. One thirty-three of four hundred, guys. Head on over to youtubecom Robitech. Hit that thumbs up button. Wow. Ugh. Oh my gosh, come on, there we go. No, they don't, Ritz, sorry. 
If you have a thumbs down complaint, let me know, man. What, what is it you don't enjoy about the show or something we can make it better? We always like to listen to feedback, too. Can the fan move up any and be in line with the cooler? No, you mean can the, no, it's centered by the frame, so no, there's no way to make it like higher. Oh, this thing is being. Oh, just being cheeky? Being cheeky? There we go. There we go. Okay, now all of our cables for the side are in. A lot more awkwardness here as we slowly work our way through this. There we go. There we go. Okay. Okay, now finally put this back on. Okay, cool. Now all of our cables are in and we have connectivity. Okay, let's flip this over, pull this stuff a little bit better. Then we'll start arranging it. Okay, let's go to side mode. Pull this through here. This is what we want our and cables to be nice and clean. There we go. It's nice and tight. You cannot see that, which is what you want. Okay, well. Okay, cool. Now, I can go to top down. Now! We can start cable managing. Start getting this thing under control. That's what we need. Whoo! It's a little bit of a little bit of a challenge, but we are making our progress. Making it happen. I don't know why I'm doing it like that, why I'm talking in that voice, but I've decided it's the right voice for the moment. Okay. So we can bring this down and then we'll bring our cables in, but let's let's tighten this stuff up. Can we use these little long ones that Frackle gave us? Because why not? Now the joy, guys, is just to get it clean. Pretty, pretty clean. And tight. And we'll make this hide the majority of the cables. Bring it down. Okay, so let's get this. Shoot. Crap. Power plus and minus, like, tricked me, guys. Dang it. Dang you, power plus and minus, and your trickery, your tomfoolery. I thought I had it. Thought moments of happiness were happening, but no. Roby's got to go back to the drawing board and figure out where the heck... Okay, it's got to go up. Everybody say, dang you, power plus and minus. Thank you very much, Torchius, for supporting me. Torchy's got it. Thank you. It means a lot to have people who support me in the community. The rest of you guys, not supportive. You should be ashamed. Okay, power plus and minus. Come here. You're so small. You bring me anger.
So the thing I love slash hate about small form factor is I love that it looks so tight and small and it looks so nice, but then I also don't like how it looks so, it is like a pain to work in. Okay. I need light to be able to see what I'm doing here. What am I doing? My non tiny fingers are really struggling. There we go. Did I get it on? Okay, got it. Okay, finally. That was a lot of blooming work, guys. Okay, that was sheesh, a lot of work. But we got it. Things in again. Fans back on. Okay, set again. I hate it when that happens and you like think you got it all and you try to do it all right. And then something like a power plus or minus cable gets in the way and robs you of your joy. But luckily, I was able to find my joy again. I get this stupid thing fixed. Okay. Okay. Whew. Luckily, Roby found his joy again, guys. I know you were worried about it. I know you were concerned. But luckily, you had nothing to be concerned about. And Roby came through. And you guys were genuinely terrified that it wasn't going to happen. I know it. I could hear it in your voices that you don't have when I'm on stream. But now I know. And I came through for you. That's right, drama, Roby. I'm trying to generate drama to uh, help create intrigue on the show. Will Dr Will Roby be able to, to do this build? Who knows? Find out next time on Roby Tech. It's like, a, it's like a radio show. We're doing like a radio show right now, right? That's what you guys want. You want a radio show, right? Are you serious, MP Junkie? I had to get the content filmed. I didn't mean to cut in front of you. Don't judge me. What's radio? Pig radio knows. Why didn't you say hi? It was my turn. I didn't, luckily I didn't play anything. All I did was go in and film very shortly and then left. 
By the way, if you guys want to see what PAX is like, what'd you guys, has anybody watched that PAX video that we released? It's pretty dang cool. This is, these are a little too thin. I want a little bit longer so I can really get some oomph in there. I'm gonna switch to these. Oh, those videos came out really good. It was good fun, yeah, I thought so. I thought it was a good, I thought it was a really good episode. I think some people, it's like a little bit more of a, I like that style of video. Those are a little bit more fun to, to do. In my opinion, so. Go give it a watch, guys. It was really good. Okay. That's pretty clean. Oh, don't throw it away. So, so do you, I'm, I'm used to mod workshops. Okay. Oh, shoot. Okay, that goes right there, okay. Where's my, oh, there, there. Oh, really? That's pretty cool, MP. Did they let you, like, was there like a limit in terms of how much, is there a limit in terms of how much you could play in the ARC truck? Like, could you only play for like an hour or was it like, could you play longer than that? Oh, 30 minutes. That's actually pretty good, half an hour. Like that was like the longest line at PAX. Do you think, let me ask you this, genuinely when you got done, were you like, I believe in Intel Arc now or no? Like, did it did it change your mind on the Arc? Or were you like, yeah, no, or, I'm just curious if like you were like, when you got done, you were like, oh, I would get this. Oh, there's a free, oh, I got a mouse, but that's right. So it was not, it had nothing to do with like whether Intel Arc was good or not, you just wanted the free mouse pad. Just being real. Well, no, of course they wouldn't let you run benchmarks. Huh? <laughs> well, I was just curious if like, if it changed your mind or, I mean, cause they're almost like, they were almost nooks, right? I forgot if they were nooks or not. I think they were nooks. I want to, I feel like they were, but I'm not sure. Honestly, we haven't benchmarked it. All I've done is got to build a system with it. So I don't, I don't actually have an opinion. I, I think, I think, I think it's gotta be priced really well like super cheap, um, which is like if they're going to get market share, that's the only way they're gonna get market share because then they can get developers to do mass adoption. Because I don't see another way to get mass adoption. You know what I mean? So I don't have, I don't have an opinion until like, like I mean the, the GPU is, is a cute looking, G I mean, it's, a, it's like nice looking, but that doesn't necessarily mean it's good, you know? It's attractive. It's attractive, but it's not more than that. Thanks, I'm glad you guys like the build. We're working on it, we're working through it. And I'm just making it look pretty. These are like a little, little loose, but.
Okay, guys, we're ready for, we're actually ready for um, some, uh, We're actually ready for the power or the GPU. So one little trick, if you want to get something tight and you have these little cables, what you can do is you can rotate them so they, they get tight and then you can just do the extra like that. It gets it a little bit tighter. So it makes it a little bit cleaner looking. Oops, oh crud. What I did not want to do. Shoot. Unless you do what I just did, which is what you do not want to do. I'll be able to get this in. go. Let me just do this. Makes it a little bit tighter. Okay, cool. So that keeps it a little bit more routed. And we've got like all the fractal logos nice and going from there. Okay, so now let's flip it over, throw our, P our uh, GPU in. But our back is done. We're looking good there. All this looks nice and clean. Here we go. Okay, time for GPU. Simple, simple. You guys like how clean it is so far? There we go. Okay, neat. Now, what we do is, let's go ahead and, there it is. Grab our 3070 Ti. this away. Okay. I'm glad you're enjoying it. There we go. Hey, W5ERX Radio, thank you very much for the sub. Okay. Put this in. I'm gonna grab this. Look all the screws and stuff are back in here, right? Okay, let's get rid of that. Okay, now let's grab our GPU. 
There we go. GPU done. Nice, easy. We're gonna use Excalibur to lock it in. There we go. There we go. We got all those in now. So we put this away. Grab this. So we make sure it matches. There we go. Nice clean look there. Okay, now we can work on PSU. Yeah, they look really clean, especially if you have like nice, almost squarish components. Ends up looking really, really good. See how that looks. What I'm working on right now is just making sure that I can twist this the way I need it to and then the cable itself still looks good. Okay. That looks good, okay, cool. Okay, all of our power supply cables are pretty much ready. Just gotta run our, get them now installed and go from there. Okay, cool. Let's grab our PSU. There we go. Now we got our RM850, the last part of this whole, this whole equation for today's build. There it is. Everybody enjoying the build? Yeah, okay, there's that. I don't need, I need one GPU cable. There we go. Yes, this is not needed. Good. 156 of 400, guys. 
Now we actually, it's a little bit lower and I'm not surprised given how little I've streamed recently. So we'll go and drop it to, let's go and drop it to 300 to see if we can get to 300 uh, likes today. So if you can head on over to youtube.com slash Roby Tech Live. Uh, we'll, uh, yeah, youtube.com slash Roby Tech Live. Hit that thumbs up button and uh, we'll, uh, we're gonna try and get it so we can do those two new egg gift cards. So just head on over there and hit that thumbs up. We'll get the numbers back up once we stream more consistently. I'll be honest, guys, I'm, I'm really sorry about that. I know a lot of people have been like, who've loved to watch and then have since kind of gone on since I've like, haven't been streaming so consistently. So that's my bad. And I feel bad for my community because I feel like I let you guys down a bit. But we are, we will, this month will be all about just re-hanging out again. So getting more streams, all that sort of stuff. So for those of you who've stuck for with me and are here and you know financially support and all that sort of stuff, you guys are big thank you. So I, I really do appreciate it. So the streams are returning to consistency and normalcy here now. Oh shoot. Uh, yeah, that's I didn't do that right. I was like, yeah, this feels like I forgot it's gonna it feels kinda tight. Oh come on. Ugh. Come on, thumb 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 thumb. There we go. There we go. A tech QA? I feel like, hold on one sec. Let me find the power, the, the screws. That's what the, that's what I'm hoping the, like the, the, the podcast stuff will be about. So to have an opportunity for people to ask that stuff, but. So I'm here and I will be here and I'm not going anywhere. There's just been a lot of learning this year. It's been a, it's been a, it's been such a crazy year for Roby Tech. It has been. It's been really bonkers, and in a good way. But in some ways, I've had to learn balance when it comes to all the things I do because I do a lot of stuff, and uh, I appreciate it. But I wouldn't be able to do it without you guys, you know. So we're working on, yeah, I'm, I'm figuring that out now. I, I know I've got, I've got some people in mind to be on it. So working on that now. So it should be soon. It just can't be on Friday because Friday's when uh, the WAN show is. And I don't feel like competing with the WAN show. But yeah, trying to figure it out, the content, how we do it, all that sort of stuff. So yeah, you guys, the Robitech community is amazing. And it's really big. That's the thing, that's the thing that's crazy. It's really big because of all of the things I do. So, and I love to meet you guys. I met so many people at PAX uh, who came and said hi, and it, that, was, that was super humbling. And so, uh, just hope we get to continue to do that stuff and meet all, a lot more people. Because you guys, you guys are why I do this. Oh, you have lots of questions for me. Hunter War's like, I got lots of questions, Roby. Well, Hunter War, I will tell you this. Like, we have some really great people in the, uh, on our Discord, in the tech chat. People like Org, people like Bmock, people like Tom, people like, uh, uh, like just our like our core tech guys, who uh, who would who if you don't want to wait, you can always add quite like Maiden, um, Icy Sniper, like people who have been doing this and know as much and sometimes if not more than I do. So if you want to get help faster, it's a great place to do that. What's up, Michael? Okay, we're almost done. 
Okay, here we go. Now it's just making this last few cables look really good. How are we doing on likes on YouTube, guys? There we go. Okay, there's that one. 172. Keep it going, guys. How high can we get it? I follow on everything. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Okay, let's get this last cable done. This is like the biggest. And there is our build, guys. Looks pretty clean. Very, not very many, not very many zip ties today. Far less than the last one for sure. Excalibur gets put away. Okay. That one can go in here. Okay. Let's put the case back together now. Let's grab the There we go. Rear panel, front looks good, right? Uh, front looks good, cool, okay. So small that it makes it really easy to kind of, I don't have to like do as much to make it fit. There we go. I like that. Uh, I like that fan, that color design there. Okay, guys, hype train should be good if we want to get that second hype train as well. So let's go ahead and get that locked in. We're gonna go through deals real quick, and then we'll turn this bad boy on. But there is the build. What do you guys think? It looks pretty good. The one thing I'm gonna do, move that a little bit up. I think the whole build actually came out. Didn't that look really clean? <clears throat> yeah, like just super, super clean, which I like, right? You're welcome, Speedy. I'm sure somebody did too. We're 263,000 raised, 132 subs already. So uh, we used the uh, 3070, Ti, uh, 3070 Ti on this one. So it's a 3070 Ti and a 5800X. Nice mid-range, small form factor build. Yeah, Riddick dropping five gifted subs. Okay, Riddick trying to get it going. Thank you, Riddick. See what we can do. Can we get our, our level two, our hype drain out of the way? And then uh, let's start the, uh, we'll do deals. Thank you, Riddick. Let's see, uh, let's see how many uh, odd, or evens, uh, odd or even zip ties today. There we go. Let's keep it going, guys. Can we get some more? 
Justin Jam. Remember, guys, you're also entered to win. We're giving away that beautiful Hunt Award drop in 10. Uh, we're giving away that beautiful uh, Stealth Project Stealth uh, Gigabyte PC, which no cables, which looks absolutely incredible. Um, so we're giving that away if we get to 200 this month. Uh, it's September, so uh, your subs are 30% off. Plus, you're entered to win a 3080 uh, if you're if you're sub during the month of September, and that gets you, uh, if you if you use your free Prime subscription, that gets you uh, a free entry. If you subscribe at tier two, that gets you um, that gets you uh, uh, sorry, subscribe at tier one, that gets you three entries. Subscribe at tier two, that gets you five, and subscribe at tier three, that gets you ten entries. So lots of opportunity there to. Uh, to win a 3080 and then of course all of that stuff goes towards that amazing um that amazing uh 3080 giveaway as well so we got to just a couple more and then we should be activating hype train it should be activated it's 7 30 and the other one was like so fast in the stream so i'm assuming it's here unless i'm wrong and blondie i think i'm right right because we should be It's so, I wish there was an easy way to tell. It's close. Oh, Blondie is, so it's not unlocked, Blondie? Dang it. Okay, let me look at the top. <laughs> oh, we're about 10 minutes out. Sorry for those who I got excited about, Order the Oak. Okay, uh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, I'm gonna do it in number of five. One, two, three, four, five, there's five, and nine. It is odd today, only nine. It's only nine, that's all we had, nine. That's it, that's it. Odd it was, guys, odd it was. That was not very many. All right, let's grab our deals and then hopefully uh, Subtrain will be up and we'll turn on the TV. We'll turn the TV. We'll turn on the, uh, we'll turn on the build. Okay, let's, let's take a look at this. Get this done. Congratulations on winning, guys, for those of you who did win. Yukon going and buying VIP. I know, sweaty. That was it was a pretty small amount, but I used a lot of. Uh, I, if you look at the back, look at the back here. What happened was, is I ended up using a lot of the. Uh, I used a lot of the routing. I mean, it's still. I mean, you have to admit, it actually looks really good. Like in terms of clean, it's very very clean. But I just didn't have to use very many zip ties. And then I like how these look because they they all end up looking kind of the same. So yeah, I think I think the back actually looks really, really good. So very nice build. All right, let's take a look at deals today. Let's see what we got. Got Logitech apparently. Okay, you guys should be able to see this here in just a second. Okay, for those who have not been here or it's been a while, let me tell you guys about just kind of the way the show goes. So we do the build and then every build or every chance, uh, at least once during the stream, uh, we try very hard uh, to uh, show you guys some quality PC building deals or deals on random crap because that's been a new thing for Tom. Um, so uh, we have a website. Uh, in case you don't know this, and there's some things that are going to be coming uh, in 2023 for this website, including written reviews, all that sort of stuff that's all coming. Uh, so you can head on over to uh, uh, www.robytech.com. On that site, you have things like our, our schedule. It's also got links to all my socials. Um, if you want to know, uh, if you want to download wallpapers, if you want to get like our build mat, all of that is all located here. I'm not going to bore you through walking you all through it. But the other thing too that we provide, and I'm a huge fan of the stuff that Tom does, uh, and that is we find deals. So if you ever want to like just look for, and that's deals on televisions, mice, PC components, pre-builds, all that sort of stuff, follow at robytechdeals.com. Um, yes, it is obviously we are getting uh, some kickback as it is affiliate when it makes sense. 
Um, but the other thing too is, I mean, Tom's literally fishing for deals all the time. So if you're looking for any of that stuff, or you're just a tech head and you're just looking for good deals, follow along there. Now, we also have those here um, on uh, the website over here on deals. You can see that right there. But the other thing too that we also have here is if you found a build, like for instance, you really enjoyed this fractal build, you can head over to uh, robitech.com slash builds. And here's, oh wow. There it is. See, this was from 20, so this was from 9 4 2021, and this was a surprise from Blondie and Tom. So, huge shout out. Thank you to them. That was such a kind message, and this is just a repeat of where it was um, a year ago. Uh, so, thank you very much for that. But you can see here that you actually see the stream build, and so here's all of the parts. Here's all of the parts from uh, that, the build that we did here. So, if you're wanting to find a build that you really like, uh, you can always jump here and do that. But let's see what deals Tom's got for us today. And guys, it's, it's anyone's guess. Let me be honest, it's gonna be anyone's guess. Okay, uh, okay, so I'm gonna keep the other ones hidden. Uh, Asus Tough Gaming Radeon RX 6900 XT. Uh, you're gonna see Radeon RX uh, GPUs continue to start jumping in price there. We definitely know that those are supposed to come out sometime this year for sure. There's been hints about them in December. Um, so if you wanna pick one up, uh, use promo code SLBBW6274. Uh, just so you know, a 6900 XT is like a 3080 Ti. So that's like a really great price. And 3080 Ti prices have not come down. We've seen 3090 Ti prices. Uh, FSR 2.0 has been is starting to kill it a little bit. I still have driver issues with my with my AMD GPUs, but um, their software continues to get better. And so the other thing too is if if you have an AMD build uh, and you also have an AMD CPU, uh, the two of them, especially with the stuff that they're doing with uh, like for instance their um, Smart Chef technology and all that other stuff, is actually pretty rad. Um, and so uh, some really good stuff if you have an all AMD uh, unified architecture. But six ninety nine ninety nine is a good price for a sixty nine hundred X. Uh, Gigabyte Aura is 15.6 IPS, 144 hertz gaming laptop. It's a 12700H, 16 gigs of memory. It comes with a 3070, 512 gig SSD for one, uh, 1240, uh, $1249.99 from Best Buy. So that's a pretty dang good deal uh, on, a, uh, on a laptop. The Wow Stick, which I didn't use at all today. The Wow Stick. If you don't know, the Wow Stick is the uh, is the my electric screwdriver. I use that on some of the bigger builds. It doesn't work very well in small uh, form factor. Uh, Thirty five twenty four on Amazon. I, I actually love this uh, love this um, screwdriver, and we use it all the time. Um, okay, uh, MSI in four uh, thirty eighty Ti. Oh wow. Okay, well never mind. Uh, this is a hell of a deal for a thirty eighty Ti. Uh, $739.99 from Best Buy. So uh, these have usually not been coming down in price, but if you're looking for a 3080 Ti, MSI Ventus is great. Doesn't have a lot of RGB, no frills cards, still three fan, uh, but $739.99 from uh, Best Buy. Excalibur. Why would you not have this? This is the single greatest screwdriver on the planet, guys. Single greatest screwdriver on the planet, Excalibur. So go pick up an Excalibur, uh, $9.99, and just be part of the Robitech slash Intel uh, Intel uh, 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 Mod Workshop crew, and it's magnetic. Yeah, there you go, it's magnetic. Uh, Thermal Grizzly three-pack of spatulas. Somebody was asking earlier about, hey, what do I use when I uh, spread thermal paste? That's what I use, they're $5.99 from Amazon. Oh, look, no surprises this time, Tom. Oh, go back to the screen. What? what? What screen? There's there. We, we let we let them do it. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Thank you. Sorry. This is what you meant. Um, OK, uh, no surprises this time. I'm a little disappointed, Tom. Uh, so uh, Corsair HX 750, 750 watt PSU, 8999 with promo code uh, Corsair. That's a great price for a 750 watt power, uh, power supply because it's going to be gold. Uh, and all that sort of stuff. Uh, one terabyte NVMe SSD for $62.49. Heck, that's, wow, that's really great. Uh, and it's got a five-year warranty. Uh, these are great. I mean, they're good PCIe Gen 3 NVMe SSDs. So, uh, Gigabyte Aura 17.3 inch. This is a 12900H with a 3080 Ti, 32 gigs of DDR5, uh, $800 off, making it $28.99.99. Wow, some really good deals on Aorus laptops. Uh, deals I'm most excited about, Excalibur, Wow stick, that 6900 XT is pretty good, and that 3080 Ti. I think these, these right here, this little L, this little, this little U, because I mean, you always need a thermal grizzly. Those are the ones that I'm most excited about. So, 
One terabyte for 63 bucks is a hell of a deal. So anyway, good job, Tom, on the deals. Good job, Tom, on the deals. Everybody say good job, Tom. And huge shout out to my, uh, tech, uh, my tech specialists, my mods, Blondie, Tom, for helping make the show every time. You guys, we can't, we can't do it without you. So I, I wanna say a, a moment to say thank you to them too. Um, yeah, so. Uh, what, what, what did Blondie say? Oh, but yeah. So that is, uh, that is the deals for today. Tom does rock and Tom does good work as does Blondie and so many other people like Cole who puts up with spam is for cooking, which it's not. Spam is for throwing in the garbage. I've actually never had spam, so I can't really say if it's bad or not. It's just spam scares me. And I know that there's a lot of like Hawaiian cooking that uses spam and I should do it. Oh yeah, sorry. Hidden, hidden, Bernie, mostly, yes. Um, all of them. You're absolutely right. I mean, uh, mostly like six, mostly and Bernie are the ones who stick around after gaming. Blondie's like, we out. Um, and so he doesn't even, she doesn't even hang out with us, but Bernie and mostly, they're like the hidden and like, and Cole, they're like the, they're like the true troopers of Roby Tech. Tom, Tom lurks though, Tom lurks though. But Blondie, she's like, we out. I don't, I don't, I gotta go play games. That's right, right Blondie? <laughs> Peace. <laughs> Hey, ben De Bandit Hero, OG, dropping 10 gifted subs. Guys, we're getting up on that 200. That's 200, almost 200, almost 10% in the first stream. Okay, let's turn this on. What do you guys think? Oh, Tom. Uh, not on games. Not on games, I don't. Okay, here's the power cable. The power, the power. I got the power. There's the power cable. Let me grab the uh, other two cables here. They're over on the other side. I like to play games once in a while. No, you don't. You just don't like us anymore, Blondie. That's what it's all about. We're not good enough. Oh, here it is. Okay. Okay, here it comes. Ooh. Oh, what's, what is this stuck on? Hold on, something's stuck. I was gonna, I lied, nothing's coming because I gotta still unwind this thing. Blondie plays mind games. Now that is the most accurate thing I've heard. So we're playing the mind games. Okay, there we go. <clears throat> okay, now that goes right here. Oh. Also, don't forget, head on over. I think Main Gear is still doing that PC giveaway. Mind games, she's like, Roby, I'm, tr I'm trapped in the, I'm trapped in the, I'm, I'm trapped in the box. Those are the mind games. Uh, Bandito Hero, I would rather build in the 5000T. I cannot stand the Helios. No, mind games, mind games, not mind games, mind games. Oh, wait, why is this not turning on? Oh, oh, don't tell me. The power switch, I'm guessing the power switch isn't all the way on. Oh no, it's on, Never mind. It is on, it's just so freaking quiet. Guys, I didn't know it was on. <laughs> I was like, why is this not turning on? Because there's no freaking RGB. I was like, why is it not turning on? Because, oh, it is on. Jeez, that was actually pretty funny. I was like, no, it's not, it's not on. It's not, it does, it doesn't, it doesn't turn on. There's no on, it is on. Oh, and by the way, guys, it also It was so good, we had no idea. See, this is why all PCs need RGB. There it is right there, posted and good to go. That, that was funny. That was genuinely funny that I had no idea that it was actually on. How are we doing on likes on YouTube, guys? That looks really good. That looks really good. Wow, that is all working. One eighty-five. Come on, let's see. If, can we get fifteen more? Head on over. Let's hit that thumbs up button. Let's get fifteen more. We'll give away one. 
15 subs. Did we, have we, have we unlocked a hype train yet? Yeah, the PC was playing a mind game too. Yep, for sure. Are you, you like that Mayans? Yeah. There it is guys, hype train. I think it's actually got an OS on it. Let me try. Let's see if we can get to a, get an OS on it. I think we already have an OS on it. Is it better to stay AMD Radeon or Intel NVIDIA or does it not matter? So you can do, you can definitely do, uh, there is benefits now to going all AMD um, and they're making that like, they're working on that more and more. Um, but I mean, like again, NVIDIA, I mean, it's still, there's still a reason so many people buy it. So uh, yeah, I mean, it's, it's, hard to, it's hard to argue that, but but there are becoming more and more benefits. So we'll have to see. I'd go all Nvidia if they made CPUs. There you go. Yeah, in the ecosystem, like they're like the smart shift, their smart access memory, um, a lot of their tech is getting really cool and FSR is getting better. It's getting wider adoption. So yeah, it's, I, you know, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna say but uh, a, there's a lot of messed up stuff. Yep, Org is right. It was like, it was flip flopping and that's what we need. We need competition, baby. That's what it's all about. So, and there it is guys, we're actually in OS too. So like it fully works. Like it's got an OS on it and everything. There it is. Look at that. Dude, this thing is like legit like, like just ready to go. Beautiful RTX whole thing. It looks really good and it's just very quiet. Like I did not know it was on because there's like no RGB. I, is there any lights on on this thing? Yeah, there's literally, you would not, there is not a single, no, there's not a single bit of RGB on this, on this thing. It is completely stealth, yeah. I think this is the first time. This actually may be a first for Robitech. Yeah, the black and white contrast is really clean. Yeah. Oh, here, I'll do a side view for you guys. See a little bit better there. Yeah, I, I agree. The black and white contrast came out really nice. No, there's like literally no light, like none. Like there's no light in this thing. Yeah. If you just looked at this, you'd have no idea it was on right now. Outside of the keyboard and the thing plugged in, yeah. It's stealth. Yeah, when it booted, but then it went away. It's a sleeper. It's like a Honda Civic with like a Aston Martin Vanquish, Vanquish engine inside of it. Yeah, actually, like I really like, like when we chose the parts for this, I thought, the build itself would actually look super clean. I think the Deep Cool Plus, the 3070 and all that sort of stuff came out really, yeah, like came out really, really nice and clean. Yeah, it really did. It did come out really nice. Um, how are we doing likes wise? But it, yes, Hunter War, you're absolutely right. It does go faster with RGB. You're, you, I cannot argue that. No, three more guys, let's get three more likes. And then we should be, I, th I think we should be, I think we should be at Hype Train. We gotta be at Hype Train. We're two hours and 31 minutes in. So the Hype Train's unlocked, right? Blondie, she's saying it's unlocked. Blondie doesn't, Blondie doesn't lie about that stuff. Can we try and unlock the Hype Train, guys? Let's see, can we get to, yeah, 20 plus, more like 50 plus. So Speedy, we actually have a white one. Uh, Riddick, okay, Riddick trying to get it going. So Riddick dropped the one in there. Let's see, can we get like three or four people? We got Bittersweet drop in. Let's see, Bittersweet tried. That's six minutes ago, so that's not gonna count. A couple hundred bits, things, stuff like that. Three or four people, and then it gets going up there. 198 likes on my side. Bit subs, donuts, guys. Let's see if we can do it. Tausa Tom dropping five, just as a big thank you. Tom, thank you. It's because he knows he got such hot deals today. Brian, not Brian, dropping a resub. Okay, two more, we should see two more and it should unlock. And then the craziness can begin. Maybe. Hunt or five, yep, yep, it's open, it's open, it's ready, it's ready. Oh, oh, 
Hype Train, Hype Hype. Okay, let's get the Hype Train unlocked and then we can uh, do the giveaways. There it is, Hype Train is going. Karingu, I love saying your name. Do I say it right, Karingu? Fozzy, what's going on, buddy? Make it an odd number. There it is, the hype is here. Okay, we're level three. Now we can make it all happen. Let's get level five, unlock that second hot thing, and we'll give away two, GP, uh, two uh, new egg gift cards. Yeah, they were, you're right, Blondie. I, I should have never dusted you. Pretty much do. Good. Hey, I'm proud of that. I wanted to say it right. And your name is really, your name is a lot of fun to say. There's Sternum 1999. We got Sergeant Newbody giving out Sergeant Newbody. We got Riddick dropping 20 gifted subs. There it is, 200. We are now 10% and it's only been the first day. 19 days left to go. We're, we got lots more streams to come. But we are 10% on our way towards that PC giveaway. Bandito Hero dropping 100 bits. We got Sub Silent dropping 1,000 bits. So many awesome gifters. Yes, thank you. Rainfall Wall dropping 100 bits. Thank you very much, my friend. Appreciate all that stuff. Now, after this, guys, uh, we're going to do our couple giveaways, and then we're going to go right into playing Steel Rising. SRT Balthazar, 20 bits. Appreciate you, too. All you guys. Catch me if you can in subs. Wow, look at that throwing down. Luckily, Farger's not here, Hunt to War. He'd, he'd, he'd chase you sometimes. Thank you for the bits, though, man. Hunt to War is going to get a name because we technically tomorrow uh, we'll have uh, we'll be doing the top three again on the board. We haven't seen Braythorn in a while either, right? Blade Seer, he's done his tons. Intel drop it. Intel was like number three last time. Four minutes left, guys, and then we're going to start getting to bed. I give up my spot. Riddick, you, uh, you, uh, I appreciate, yeah, because you're like, you've got one hashtag so far. Igor and Riddick are at the top. You guys ready for some gaming? 204 YouTube goals. Okay, let's do the giveaways and then let's shut this down and let's get the games ready. I feel like that's the right thing. Thank you everybody for tuning in for the first stream. So I think the last one that we did was like August, like it was almost, what, almost 20 days ago. It was a while. So thank, I mean, I'll, yes, we did mod workshops, but obviously these are much more fun because um, it's just me hanging out with you guys. So let's get some, you ready to check out a new game? We're gonna play a Souls game, brand new game, Steel Series. Uh, it's from uh, Spider, uh, Spiders is the name of the company. Um, and then huge shout out, we got, we, I ended up like with my new, I don't know if you guys know this, but I ended up signing with a new agency. Uh, they're called, uh, they're called SideQuest Media. And so uh, it's through them, uh, they ended up getting me the, uh, the key. So you guys can check it out. And so we're doing, uh, we're doing, uh, we're definitely doing more uh, gaming stuff here and doing some more, showing some more of that stuff off so you guys can see that stuff too. But there it is with the glass, by the way. And it's actually, it's actually not that, it's much lighter than I kind of anticipated. So there it is right there. The build is done. It gets put away. And then let's start the giveaway process. We're gonna give away two, two New A gift cards. Cause you guys are rock stars. Oh, Cloudbot. Giveaways. Giveaway setting, exclamation point Newegg now, guys. Two $25 Newegg gift cards up for grabs, starting that right now. I'm gonna pick two. Yeah, light leg workout versus this one. Time to get this system up. Ugh. Much smaller. Ugh. I think it's this one. No, those are. It's this one. Nope. I think I have to grab that one. There we go. 
we go. And I decided we're gonna actually use Hunt to War, thank you very much, 55 seconds. Lo dropping all sorts of bits, you guys, Jeez, You guys are so kind. Okay, that's what I was looking for. Forty seconds. Okay, we're gonna use, I keep not using this and I need to more often. So we're gonna go back to using my glorious custom keyboard that I built. I don't know if you guys have ever seen this. I actually built this one. I got another one that's like half built back here. There it is. using uh, golden pandas. Yeah, it's our DIY, my DIY keyboard. Okay, drawing two winners. Congratulations to B Santa B S N T A D info. I don't know what that means. And Mayakins. Congratulations, Mayakins and B, whatever the other name was. Sorry, I wish I knew it. Unless I'm like really just missing how to say it, which is very realistic and happens quite a bit with me. So I could say that that's a very real chance. Okay, let's get this set up here. Put this over. Okay, let's grab our mouse. I need to find, I need to go, I need to get some sort of really cool mouse. I mean, I like this one because this one was given to me for Cooler Master and it was like a rare, it was just for the year, the mouse mouse. So it was like kind of like this cool thing, but it's time to get to a different mouse. It's like crazy light though. Okay, there we go. Turn it on. There we go. Now the, the, the screen is not on because I have to do duplication, so sorry about that. I'm going from there. Okay, let's get our stream up here real quick. And let's get restream up. There we go, I can see you guys. Got restream up now. There we go, we're gonna make sure we duplicate this screen. We should be good. Okay, let's do duplicate these. Changes and then go to. There you go. Okay, there we go. Okay, now we have audio. Okay, cool. So we got that stuff set up. Okay, for those of you guys who don't know, uh, thank you very much for all the winners. Congratulations to them for hanging out and all that sort of stuff. Uh, we are getting ready to transition over to the gaming section of the uh, of the uh, show for tonight. Um, if you're curious, uh, if you're over at YouTube, uh, or if you're over on Facebook, which we do have a Facebook faithful on the YouTube uh, things, uh, what do you think of the new rise? Will they overheat? Here's some heating issues. Amol, nobody knows. Nobody actually, I know that people don't have uh, samples yet, so uh, if whatever you're hearing is probably not true. Uh, I, I think only some, so if you're, uh, wait till we officially get to test them. Um, but anyway, uh, if you are at YouTube, head on over to twitch.tv slash Robitech because we are going to be saying goodnight to our YouTube audience uh, because, again, uh, gaming, it, I want to make sure that YouTube doesn't freak out because we're changing our content, etc. cetera. Uh, and if you're over on Facebook, again, also appreciate you guys joining us and all that sort of stuff. Uh, next stream is tomorrow. We're, uh, tomorrow, uh, we are either doing a finishing the custom water-cooled 5,000, uh, 5,000T build or we're going to be doing a um, we're going to be doing a commission build. We're essentially waiting for a motherboard to come back. That's we found an issue with the motherboard. We're just waiting for it to come in. It's supposed to come in tomorrow. If it does, then we'll move forward with that. 
uh, but we're not we're just not sure if it's going to be here on time uh, and then also don't forget we have Amazon tomorrow at noon so if you want to tune in for that uh, we got some awesome tech deals going into the weekend and that's always just a fun show great chance to just come and ask questions so that's going to be happening at noon PST and then stream will follow again at 5 p.m. PST uh, and then so that's kind of it for the weekend and that's what's going to be happening moving forward so for youtubers and for facebookers we say good night for everybody else stay tuned we're going to be playing steel series uh sorry steel rising not steel i've been saying steel series forever uh because i'm just so used to that uh steel rising really great game i think you guys are going to enjoy it uh, and we're going to be jumping into that in just a second so that is the plan moving forward uh, uh sorry 1 p.m sorry amazon is at one you're right blondie my bad amazon is at one so uh, thanks, Yukon. I really appreciate it. Okay, so we're going to ju jump over to the side camera, and then I'm going to say goodbye to YouTube. So YouTube and uh, Facebook, we love you, and we'll see you